we know that that's not the case. Now, if you're talking about the flat earth theory from the Genesis creation account, uh, that is an interpretation error. <clears throat> and I am 29 years old. There were some uh, people in just five, six hundred years ago that thought the earth was flat because of the observation of, the, of their, their perspective of the horizon. They, they believed that it was flat as a result. So it's not just the Bible doing it, it's people's perceptions that can be altered. And, and if you know somebody in the Bible perceived the earth as flat, well, then they might just write it down like that. But we know that that particular person was uh, had a, a, a poor perception or did not know. They were just plain ignorant. But that, that was going on for thousands of years because of people's perception. But that doesn't negate the truth of the Bible. You know, they were real people that wrote it. And they had flaws just like everybody else. But that was also their purpose in life. So, perhaps that sheds some insight on it. Well, ignorance is, for me, or ignorant person, is something that you are, you are claiming to know something that is obviously inaccurate because it can be proven. That's true ignorance. Um, if you are ignorant because you don't know something, um, that's just being naive. Well, that's what I believe, Freetard, in the young earth, yes. Oh yeah, my Dino Channel views are awesome. A lot of hits today. It's good stuff. Do, 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 do. Where is this cave? I found the one, but it was nothing. It's a good thing I brought my compass with. Oh, more reeds. Excellent. We need those. Oh, we're coming up on a snowy biome. Interesting. Let me collect these reeds first. <laughs> yeah, right? Well, you know, my YouTube does okay. Oh, I think here's the rest of the cows we need. Oh, the water cave. Epic trolling right there. happened oh okay ah yes the whole 2012 prediction do you know how many times they have predicted that the world is going to end and it's always been different propaganda but the same BS it just scares people well your history book will tell you that the agricultural revolution happened more than 6,000 years ago but that information could also be inaccurate you know, there are some folks that are not believers that uh, that say that uh, you know the human race is about ten thousand years old. I mean, there's there's always a margin of error. Yeah, the world ended in uh, two thousand. Y two K. It ended in 2004 with the presidential election and again in 2006 with the earthquake, I think it was. Well, that's fine, but what about the research? How accurate is that? Who has access to the case studies? Only the people that did it. And uh, you never know, did they get paid off to say certain things or maybe they just really hated the Bible and you know wanted to disprove it so they printed this stuff out I mean that kind of stuff goes on all the time 
it, it, you know, I examine both sides, but it's, yeah, scientists, like I said, scientists aren't generally uh, very rich. They get grant money to do their research, and if the research is conclusive to prove a point that somebody already wants to be proven, then chances are the scientists are going to find the answer that person was looking for. I mean, it's really that simple. You know, if you have a, a fossil and you take it to the Smithsonian Museum, you call them up and say, I want this fossil dated. They actually ask you how old you think the fossil is, and then they try to date it based on that prediction. I mean, that right there is just backwards. So if you believe that the Earth is young, you're going to say, well, I believe this fossil is about 4,300 years old, and they're going to date it, and they're going to shoot for that answer, that result. If you believe that the Earth is billions of years old, then they're going to do the same dating process and research, and they're going to hit a mark that's right around there. Try it sometime. And that's kind of evidence right there that not all information is considered accurate. It just depends on the source and who wants the answer. I found some I have fossils. I mean, I find fossils in the in the uh, concrete at jobs that I've had. You know, from from leaves and stuff that have fallen in there while they were making the building. Uh, I've found Indian arrowheads buried in different things. So, you know, I found a few. Nothing like major, because I'm not an archaeologist. I don't go on big digs and stuff. Well, you're not going to like this, but if the Earth is only about 6,000 years old, that can only mean that dinosaurs and man and everything else lived at the same time. That's what that's all about. Because that is what the Bible says. Which is another great avenue for people who denounce it because they just say, well, that's obviously wrong, so... No, there's still dinosaurs alive. Go ahead and take a look. I mean, besides all of the sightings that people have of strange creatures, what about lizards or the Komodo dragon, closest descendant of the dinosaur? I mean, dinosaurs still are still around. It's just that the dinosaurs back then had a different environment, and most of them did die out. But there are still dinosaurs alive. I mean... <laughs> They're creatures that are still considered dinosaurs. That's all dinosaurs were, were giant lizards. So, I'm not sure where people miss the boat on that one. Now, the book says they're all extinct, but they're talking about the dinosaurs of the children's books. And you can't deny all the giant fossils that they find. I mean, these creatures really existed. <laughs> it's just that the timeline is off depending on who you talk to. Now, see, here's more extreme hills, but I can't find no cave entrance. Oh, oh, wait, I spoke too soon. But never mind, it's a dead end. They're all dead ends. I'm being trolled epically. Oh, boy. See, now you can tell. I'm going to put this stuff on YouTube, and that's going to make the comments go crazy. Like, Sorv is an insane person. That Bible thumper doesn't know what he's talking about. <laughs> that's okay. People can scoff at me all they want. My faith will not waver. But it is interesting to discuss, because it seems like the more it's talked about, the more confused people get. Hmm. And what server would that be, James? Yeah, I actually didn't check the link because I'm doing the stream and I, I don't want to get too distracted from all of that. And I'm not sure what this hill is, but I want to know what's on the other side. Oh, it's more hills, okay. Really hope I don't run into too much resistance out here, you know. <coughs> I 
I just 